Top 10 Rarest Akedo Warriors Series 1 Edition Number 10 Pride Heart Pride Heart isn't only a fierce warrior and a valuable addition to any collection, he's also the winner of our first Akedo tournament. And as you'll see here, we only have two doubles of him. It's really because we used a bunch of Pride Hearts for our Mandalorian giveaway, but this list is based on the top 10 rarest warriors currently in our collection. Number 9 Shreddy Bear It's really a shame that Shreddy Bear is on the list because as you can see from his intro, I really want to turn him into Freddy Fazbear. With his bear-like feet and patches of fur appearing randomly on his body, he really is the perfect starting point. But because we only have two doubles of him, we'll have to be really careful how we use him to get the most out of this rare bear. Number 8 Burnout we just torched through two of these guys, but if you saw our Ghost Rider video, I think you'll agree it was well worth it. We're down to just two spare burnouts, but that does leave the possibility of more Ghost Riders in the future. This figure truly is one of a kind, and even though he's probably someone you would rather be fighting against than fighting with, do not trade him away as you may never get your hands on him again. Number 7 Shutdown. Like all the legendary warriors, Shutdown is one of a kind and he shares his mold with no other figure. That may be for the best however, because he's the easiest figure to break and definitely not someone you want to be using on a daily basis. We currently have two doubles of him, with our third sitting safely in our collector case, but stay tuned because from here, the warriors get really rare with all of them being the only one in our collection. Number 6 Screenshot Screenshot is an exclusive ultra rare figure and the only way you can get him is by purchasing the battle arena. That fact alone makes this warrior a must-have and a permanent resident on the rarest warrior list. He's a really cool one-of-a-kind figure that wields a massive club and shield. You gotta be pretty lucky to get a battle arena, so lose or damage your screenshot and you may never have him again. This is the one and only screenshot in our collection. Number 5 Turbo Chucks Lee. This is a no-brainer as Turbo Chucks Lee is the second exclusive ultra rare warrior that comes with the battle arena and another must-have figure to complete the Kato Series 1 collection. While the figure itself is just an alternate paint scheme of Chucks Lee, his weapons make him truly unique. If you're lucky enough to get this rare warrior, remember not to fight him too hard or he'll end up with a broken arm like ours. This is the one and only Turbo Chucks Lee in our collection. Number 4 Ultravolt I'm not sure if Ultravolt comes in the one player packs, but I do know that we got this Ultravolt in a 4 figure collector pack that I bought specifically for him. He shares the same body mold as Hyperlock and has the same dual swords as Glitchblade. But if you're trying to complete your Akedo Warrior collection, you need to find the Ultravolt Collector Pack. This is the one and only Ultravolt in our collection. Before we jump into the top 3 rarest Series 1 Akedo Warriors, some of you may have noticed how clean and white my desk is today, and it's because I painted it with Rust-Oleum Enamel Gloss White Paint. This paint is oil based, so it's really smelly. But after it dries, it leaves a hard protective shell and it looks really good. Number 3 
Fly Swat. Fly Swat is another warrior that we got in a four figure collector pack and I believe that's the only way to get your hands on one. He has the same mace and shield configuration as Dark Sting and he shares a body mold with Tail Whip. But that's where the similarities end. Fly Swat is one of only four Series 1 warriors that glows in the dark. He's a really nice figure and a must have for your Akato collection. This is the one and only Fly Swat in our collection. Before we move on, let's take a quick look at some of our more abundant warriors. All of these figures you see here I would classify as common as we have 10 to 11 duplicates of each. And I have big plans for these guys. We're going to customize all of them into some of the most awesome and fiercest warriors you have ever seen. I saved our most abundant warrior for last. It's White Wraith. And see if you can count how many we have. Number 2 Tear Bear Tear Bear is number 2 on the list and like the previous two figures we got him from a 4 player collector pack. I really don't think you can get him in a 1 player pack but let me know in the comments section if I'm wrong. Tear Bear is one of my favorite warriors and there's something about him that separates him from his body double Shreddy Bear and every other warrior for that matter. He has a furry left foot. It doesn't help him in combat or anything, unless you rub it for good luck maybe. This is the one and only Tear Bear in our collection. These warriors just missed the list. Number 1 Limited Edition Mythical Stormstrike there are only 1,000 in existence. He's the only warrior to come with his own collector card. And he glows in the dark. Stormstrike is probably the most sought after warrior in a Kato Series 1. It may have something to do with the fact that he's nearly impossible to get. We were lucky enough to unbox him in one of our opening videos. And if you haven't seen it, you need to check it out. I hope you guys liked our list, let me know in the comments if you agree or disagree and who's your rarest Akato warrior. Please consider subscribing and leaving a like if you haven't already, we really appreciate all of the support. Thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you in the next video.